zombie apocalypse. Good day, sixth grade friends. I have got another Google Doc lesson for you. I'd like you to simply visit Google, click on the Apps button, and let's launch Google Docs. When it appears, I want you to choose a blank document. In that blank document, I want you to name it Pics, and I want you to put your initials. Don't put my initials, because that'll make me laugh, and I don't want to have to laugh. All right, in your amazing new document, I would like you to type your first and last name and put the second label, Pictures of Things I Like. Once you've got that done, I would like you to select all of them with the mouse, pick a font that you think is awesome, pick a size, somewhere around 24 or 30, click the cool button to center it, and then pick a nifty font color. When you've got it like that, head to the next training movie. At this point, I need you to press enter after the things I like, and I want you to make a special table. Let's click insert, and I need you to insert a table, and I want it to be three by four. When you click, it shows up nice and big, and then I want you to type these words. In the first one, I want paste. In the second one, I want URL. And in the third one, I want uploaded. They are all way larger than I want, so I want you to get them back to size 12. I want you to click on the cool adjustment tab. Now, I can't see mine, so I have to click the more button. Yours will probably be spread out farther, and you'll be able to just center align yours. And then I also want these, I'm going to say, to be black. If you want a different color there, that's fine. I am also going to pick a different plain font, so I like Arial for these. When you get your setup like that, you may head to the next training movie. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is where the fun happens. We're going to put pictures in each of these boxes using a couple of special techniques. The first one I want you to do is start a brand new tab, and in the tab, type something you like. I like the Detroit Lions, and when it pops up, I want you to choose the Image button. When you look at the images, find one that you think is cool. Uh... Click on it, and then right-click, copy the image. Not the address, the image. You can click back to see all the pictures after you're done, but you'll use that later. And then simply go back to the document and right-click, paste that picture in. If it works fantastic, if it's too large, click on it and shrink it down so that they all fit better. Use that technique to put three pictures of things you like in the paste column. Ladies and gentlemen, let me show you how to do the URL training. Once again, we're going to click insert and we're going to do image, but instead of upload or any of the other ones, we are going to go to URL. To do this, you get to this screen and then go back to your search, find the image you like, click on the image to get in it, and then right click on this and choose copy image address which is the URL then when you go back to your document you can paste that in if the picture shows up you've got a good one and you can hit select and then it'll show up you can still click and shrink and adjust to get them so they're the right size so that all your pictures will fit but that is the technique I want you to use for all three of the URL pieces. The last strategy I want to use is where we upload them. And this can be uploaded from many places, but we're going to upload them to our drive from Google. So I'm going to go to the Google page, and this time I'm going to type cars. They're still medium size, which is good. I like this car, so I'm going to click on it, and then I'm going to right click on it, and then I'm going to do save image as. When I save this image, it says where do I want to put it. Yours will look a little different than mine, but I want you to choose the desktop image. And I just want you to call this uh, pick one, because we will delete these later. 
once you get it saved to the desktop then I want you to go back to your picture page and I want you to go insert image and this time we want to do upload and it says we can drag the image here so I'm gonna move my screen to the right and after a bit of searching on my desktop I see that picture so I'm just gonna drag it on the upload button and it put it in just perfect I'll have to move this over for you so you can see it but you can see that one is now uploaded I want you to use that same technique to save two more to your desktop and then upload them as well when you're done with that go to the next at this point I would like you to click below our table and press enter and then I want you to write a description of how to do these steps so start by typing these are my instructions for what we just learned and then turn on this cool tool called bullets and I want you to tell me the paste technique the URL technique and the uploaded technique in your own words so for instance I put the paste technique was as a start and then I would talk about what I had to do or to use the paste technique I went to a website and tell me the steps you need to do for paste and then when you press enter notice it gives you another bullet and then explain the URL and then lastly explain uploaded these are in your own words and when you're done I am going to look at these to see if you really understand how we did each of those techniques if you can't remember the techniques you can go back and watch the movies to relearn how I taught you to paste them use the URL and upload so at this time get to work on creating those explanations and then make sure that you call me over so I can see when you have completed lesson four it will look a lot like this you will have three pictures you pasted three pictures with URLs and three pictures that were uploaded and then you will have your awesome destruction uh, instructions of the techniques that you did when that's done it's time to turn it in and I'm gonna tell you to close that window go back to our mod tech course the computer course and get into our Google classroom once you're in Google classroom click on sixth grade computers and find the assignment lesson four pictures when you open it it has the blank file that I gave you a long time ago we don't want that one so we're gonna remove it and then we're gonna add from our Google Drive when you click on Google Drive it says which one are you adding and you find your awesome one that you finished with your pictures when you add that it'll show up right there and then you can click turn in it'll be submitted for the project and you say yep because that is what we want to do so make sure you're submitted yours so I can grade it and then we can move on to the next Unicorn Zombie Apocalypse.